we can decide not to build general superintelligences. I mean, the United States might be able to conjure up enough enthusiasm for that. But if the United States doesn't build general superintelligences, then China are going to have the big advantage, right? So right now, at those levels, whoever has more advanced AI has more advanced military. No question. We see it with existing conflicts. But the moment you switch to superintelligence, uncontrolled superintelligence, it doesn't matter who builds it, us or them. And if they understand this argument, they also would not build it. It's a mutually assured destruction on both ends. Is this technology different than, say, nuclear weapons, which require a huge amount of investment and you have to like enrich the uranium and you need billions of dollars potentially to even build a nuclear weapon? But it feels like this technology is much cheaper to get to superintelligence potentially, or at least it will become cheaper. 